Hey everyone, welcome to our new video. I have found another free AI model and its name is Kimi 1.5 and it is a multimodal reasoning model and in many cases it is completely beating the DeepSeek. Here you see that Kimi 1.5 beating DeepSeek in benchmarks and also if you see this chart it is completely beating this OpenAI O1 and OpenAI O1 Mini also and Cloud 3.5 Sonnet. We know that OpenAI O1 or this O1 Mini is a paid model but this free model, this Kimi 1.5 is completely beating that paid model. Okay, and here you see that this is a simple interface. Here you can keep the prompts and here you will get advantage of this online. So if you are, if I hover on this online, here you see that connected to internet and Kimi will collect information through the internet when needed. But if you turn off this, then you can uh, see that Kimi's internet access has been disabled. So we have seen this uh, internet access in case of GPT or DeepSeek also. They have a web search option. When you turn on that, you can access to the internet, right? And also they have one uh, very complex model. This Kimi 1.5, here you see that long thinking. So if you select this model, then uh, you can perform the complex visual and text reasoning tasks. So if I show you the features, here you see that uh, they have given this image to code, geogesser and this uh, visual confusion, identification and color and quantity recognition. So if I show you this image to code, so they have given one example. See here that uh, we are making a web page and there I need an email and this name, age, all of this information like the input field will be there on my page. Okay. And here you see that when you upload this image, uh, this uh, model, this Kimi 1.5 actually read your image and it will generate the code. Here you see that get the user input, email, name, all of this information. Okay. So that means you can uh, convert your image to code. Next is the GeoGuessr game. So here you see that identify and pinpoint locations in geography games uh, like a pro. So they have given one example also. You see that uh, uh, let's play a geogesser game and guess the location in the picture where is this. So here if you upload the picture of, of a place, okay, like if you upload the place of a Switzerland or uh, like England or Australia, United States, okay. So in that case, uh, if you don't have idea about that place, then it, this model, this Kimi 1.5 will give you the information. So here you see that. Uh, they have uploaded one images and this Kimi 1.5 is telling that this looks like a Machu Picchu and uh, a famous historical site in Peru. Okay. So now next thing is that if I show you, they have mentioned color and quantity recognition. So if I show you uh, this color and quantity recognition, here you see that do your best to identify the flowers in the bucket and create a table listing their colors flow uh, flower names and the quantities uh, needed so here you see that uh, they have uploaded one uh, some of the flowers and here you see that we got the output that uh, this color pink and flower name roses and quantity is 3 so they have found this quantity 3 from here and after that this orange color flowers purple color flowers so that means it has the color identification capability right and all of our all of these are completely free and next one is this visual confusion identification so for this they have uh, tried this prompt here you see that uh, put the results in a four cross four table in the picture a blueberry muffin and uh, this uh, animal picture is given so actually this this muffin and uh, this picture okay uh, these are actually similar okay and uh, but they have asked this model uh, that uh, if it has the capability to differentiate between these two things or not okay so because in your naked eye uh, if you uh, watch this this looks exactly similar you see but these are not two these two are not same things okay so here you see that it has identified and it is telling that the first object is muffin and the second object is dog third object is muffin and fourth object is dog okay so it has identified from this grid okay so that means it has this capability this visual confusion identification next if i show you 
they have also told us that uh, they have the capability for the image to chart so transform visual data into clean and understandable charts so here you see that uh, it has given this that please read the product parameters and present them in a table format so this is the things that they have uploaded and after that we got this table format data okay so that means uh, it has this image to chart option okay and next one is this uh, brand identification recognize and identify the brands from the logos or product images so here you see that for this they have uploaded these uh, two images and uh, it uh, they told this model that compare the feature of these two product and organize them into a table okay so it identified the uh, the these two product also so it identified that the first one is the xbox series uh, controller and the second one is this playstation 5 dual scene controller and they have done the full comparison also from this uh, product images okay isn't it cool okay so how to use it okay i have given this link so this is the link that kimi.ai so if you go to this link you will find this type of interface if you uh, don't have account in this website means if you are not logged in then you will find this option now to use the kimi 1.5 make sure you log in to this uh, kimi okay so when you click on this login it will ask for the phone number so give your phone number according to the country that you are living okay after that now after the verification you will be able to uh, log into this uh, kimi 1.5 and you can uh, find this type of interface okay and here you can select this kimi 1.5 long thinking and you can ask any question and here you see that uh, you will get the option to upload the file also maximum 50 files you can upload and 100 mb each and all of this pdf doc uh, excel ppt text and images are supported and uh, if i show you by asking one question here you see that i have a bunch of question so let me uh, pick up this fifth question so if i copy this question and uh, if i go to this uh, interface and here if i paste it and press enter so here you see that it is doing the thinking so they have also told us a searching and reasoning option and the answer should be 54 here you see that i got the answer this 54 okay so here you see that i got the answer 54 and all of the steps that is it thought they have given also okay so in this way you can try this model i have given all the links in the description box please check there and if you are new to this channel please don't forget to subscribe this channel guys because i make every day new videos for you it really motivates me when you like these videos and when you subscribe this channel so see you guys in the next video thanks for watching